We are uh, located in the western part of Romania, in Timisoara, but we are serving uh, clients throughout uh, Romania in the main uh, cities. Uh, and um, I would like to pinpoint that um, in Romania, in terms of digitalization, we have a sort of a paradox. Um, according to statistics, our uh, SMEs, they are low uh, in the um, uh, absorption and the adoption of digital uh, tools. Uh, on the other hand, uh, Romania has uh, a very good um, uh, Wi-Fi uh, connection uh, access. Um, and uh, on the other hand, as well, and we did this, uh, we did a study. We surveyed citizens in Timisoara, and we understood that the degree of use of digital uh, technologies uh, and tools is quite high in all age um, age ranges. So uh, let's say that Romania, uh, it's, it's a country that produces many ICT uh, professionals. Uh, but on the other hand, as a, as a mainstream adoption, we don't see yet the results. But uh, well, I'm sure that uh, this will happen uh, in the upcoming years, hopefully in a speedy way. Uh, being uh, today at the, at, in Budapest for the I4MS uh, um, uh, final event, which is a big milestone for the entire three-year work, and myself being as well an I4MS ambassador for more than one year, um, I am very happy to see that um, um, professionals and experts, people coming from various organizations, they can be on one hand intermediaries, they can be companies, they can be universities or public administration. They are um, actually looking into the same direction. Uh, nevertheless, they use different terminology and perhaps they also have different expectations. But the thing is that they look for the same aim. Um, I, I mentioned in the, in the previous workshop that uh, might be overwhelming for companies uh, to see that digitalization is a new wave and then okay we uh, one more wave one more wave uh, green innovation one more wave uh, but uh, what I usually say to companies is that think about um, digitalization and climate change and the crisis that we need to manage and the transformation that we need to do think as innovation management because innovation management is already dismantled. It is already, companies are already, let's say, accustomed with it. It's a tamed um, concept. It's not very much so wild anymore, okay? Then secondly, um, I4MS uh, is, is offering something key to the companies. It's offering processes that work. Uh, I, I always say to companies, sometimes managers ask me, what should I do? Well, it's not, a consultant's role to give advice and uh, a consultant's role is to provide processes so objective processes and I4MS is doing this in in many ways so coming from um, resources training funding access to organizations to people this these are already processing that that worked and last but not least, I would like to focus upon the fact that when we talk about digitalization, we need to understand that from the point of companies, from the point of view of companies, there are two, at least two possibilities. One is that uh, digitalization can be an enabler for your company, can uh, support you to gain more income, to sell faster, to attain new markets. Uh, this is one case. And the other case is that sometimes technology is part of your core business or will become part of your core business. It will be critical for the development of the company. And as a company, you need to understand in which situation you are because the effort and the resources that you put in these two cases, they are totally different. All in all, from what I see is that companies are really very proficient, very well experienced. Nobody knows a company's inside uh, information better than their team. But I4MS is here to optimize, to bring in, to fill, to fill in gaps, to optimize, to connect dots, those critical points that can make a shift in a company's life.